What's good, YT? It's Platinum. I want to come and say Happy New Year. Happy New Year, YT. Hope everyone had a good New Year's Eve and bought it in safe. But anyway, I want to share what I'm cooking. Um, I'm making some chicken tenders. Uh, and I put basically the curry chicken tenders. Um, Miss Carrie on YT on Instagram, probably like a year back or so, she gave me this. Um, recipe how she made fried chicken but use it with curry seasoning so I seasoned up the chicken with curry powder some black pepper all bay seasoning mixed it with some flour and then I made some buttermilk homemade buttermilk because I didn't have any and basically let the chicken sit in there y'all excuse me let the chicken sit in there then after it's already batted in the flour, then stick it in the buttermilk and then rebat it again in the um, flour. And that's going to give it that crunch and make it um, moist in the inside. And that's it. Pretty, pretty simple. And I put some curry, a little curry in the flour as well. Not that much. So I'm going to show you all how it looks. I also made some um, black eyed peas and I'm going to make, I have some rice left over from the other night. I'm going to heat that up and then make a little side salad and I'll come back and show you guys once I plate up. That's my black eyed peas. I got some turkey necks in there. This is my um, turkey tenders. They're about ready to come out. And I got the oven. Yeah, they're ready to come out. I got the oven going. So I'm going to put them in the oven for a little while. After I put them on the paper towel and drain them. And that's it. Like I said, I hope you all um, had a good New Year's Eve and May you get everything you want and be prosperous in 2015. All right, y'all. I'll come back once I've played up. I think I left them ones in a little too long. But y'all already know that ain't going to go to waste, right? <laughs> All right, y'all. So I'm back to show you guys. Once you let it sit in the buttermilk, you just want to let the excess buttermilk drain off, then dip it in the flour. Y'all forgive me for the sake of news. And that's pretty much it. You may want to coat, make sure you coat all the turkey. I wasn't happy with that first one. I'm in there cleaning and wasn't paying attention to what I'm doing and overcooked that one. So I got to watch this one. Y'all get the drift of it. All right. And I'll be back with the final presentation. So I'm back to show you um, the final results. I uh, took mention earlier I had some rice left over with some yellow gourd rice and I sauteed some onions first and some olive oil and then that's what I got. You guys already see saw the black eyed peas and this is what the chicken's supposed to look like. I mean, I keep saying chicken because it looks like chicken. But it's not. It's turkey. So, let's see if I can do this without dropping it. 
Y'all know your girl is super, super clumsy. Okay, so here is the final presentation. I got my Goya yellow rice, a little side salad topped with um, salad supreme seasoning, and then my black eyed peas. My daughter called me, and she's on her way home from work. She asked me what I was doing cooking. So, what you cook, Mom? So, I told her. She said, what? You fried something? For real? Like, I can't even remember the last time I personally fried food for me. But I used pure granola oil and mixed it half with some olive oil. And so, yep, diggle my New Year's dinner. Y'all comment down below and tell me what y'all eat or eat will be eating for um, New Year's. Hopefully I get this uploaded January 4th, 2015. But knowing me, I'll probably be behind. Again, Happy New Year's. I'm going to get out y'all ear. Y'all already know what it is. As always, keep it sexy. Toodles, y'all.